How are dinosaurs excavated? Well, certainly not, you know, the way we see it in movies, like Jurassic Park. You know, that is fiction. Dinosaur excavations are far more complicated than, you know, Jurassic Park. Often, you have landscapes like this, you know, where you have all those boulders that are on top of the bones and the rocks that contain the bones. You have to get those boulders out and clear the area, sometimes by hand, sometimes by, you know, heavy machinery. You know, and then obviously the team is going to be working with tools of all sorts, um, sometimes jackhammers, shovels, uh, pickaxes, and so on. Slowly, the quarry is going to grow, you're putting your tents, you see, you know, more of that, more of the work, and the first bones that look pretty nice are becoming, you know, visible. You see part of the tail of a long-necked dinosaur there, a sauropod, a femur, the thigh bone of another long-necked dinosaur, right? And eventually the excavation turns into some form of a small compound there, you know, with tents and tools and people coming and going and so on, even a parking lot, like here, right? <laughs>